guys, welcome back to a new video on the Wanna Sister channel where we talk about everything Fortnite creative related. Today we are going over the end game device. Um, this is a really cool device if you want to end the game. But before we get started, let me roll the intro. Okay guys, there's one thing I want to say before we get right into this device's settings. I want to say thank you so much for uh, help for helping me get monetized on YouTube. You guys, I monetize. If below this video you say, see a thanks button, it might say thanks eventually. Um, you can donate to help support the channel. Thank you guys. You guys are amazing for subscribing and supporting the channel. All your comments. I read like and reply to every comment. I am not lying. I do go down to the comments and look. I reply to all my comments. So if you have any questions about any of this, comment down below. Okay. So now let's get right into the device. So let's go right into the end, end game device settings. Okay. We're going to start with the first setting up here. What to end. What to end. So... This is either end round or end game. So end the round is if you have multiple rounds, it'll end just that round. If you end the game, it'll end the whole game and you will start over completely. And you won't. And it'll just start the game over. It's pretty pretty simple. I'm going to do end, end game. The next setting on here is winning team. Okay. So the winning team. So that's whenever this device gets triggered. triggered this is the winning team. And you can set it to the activating team you can set it to winning team this is the person who actually won the game with their score or their points on the side uh you can set it to that the other one over here is activating team whoever activates this end game device will be the winning team so say you had a parkour course and the first team to make it across and click a button or step on a device that will trigger this device to end the game and they will win the game that team that completed that obstacle course. Um, and then also, there's all these team five. There's all these other teams on here. Uh, for me right now, this doesn't really matter. So I'm just going to set this for winning team or activating team because I'm going to be clicking a button to activate this device. Next down here, we've seen this a lot. These are custom victory callouts and custom defeat callouts. These are the victory say. So like you could say, you win or you could... Or that's we win. <laughs> we could you could say like you win, or you could say you lose. So it's basically you could type in anything you want here. It's I really like this. You could type in anything you want, and yeah, it's really cool. This is in the My Island settings too. If you want to type that in there. Next down here, enable at game start. This will say if it's enabled or disabled at the game start. So if you don't want this enabled as soon as your game starts, I will put it at disabled. But if you want it just constantly, you should put it at, at enabled. And once we do get down to the bottom here, it will say enabled and disable when receiving from. You could put channels in here whenever you want the thing to enable, the device to enable or disable. So we'll get down there in a second. Next thing down here, activating team. This is the team that is allowed to activate it. And that goes along with class too. Team and class are the ones that are allowed to activate it. So both of these, you could pick any of these teams. Just it goes all the way up to Team Fifty. Uh, I think this one only goes up to Class Sixteen. There's only sixteen classes in the game, so this is the team and the class. Team and class are very similar. If you don't know what class means. It's just like it's another form of team, but it's separate individual players, and it's not a team, pretty much. Next one down here. We're almost completed. Activate when receiving from. So this is the channel that you want the device to activate on to end the game so you can put this on any channel up to 300 now apparently they added up to 300 channels that's insane you could do a lot with that in your maps so you can put it up to any channel for this video we're gonna i'm gonna put it at one because that's the button we're gonna trigger to activate this device 
So that means when we activate the button on channel one, it'll activate the device. And I'll place down the button in just one moment. Let's move on down here, enable and disable. We've seen this, it's almost on like every device in creative. Do you want the device, device to enable or disable? Obviously, you don't really need to enable if you already have enable at game start on, which I do. Uh, this is your preference. Channels are like what you want to activate and what you want to enable and disable whenever you use a device. Sorry, I just hit my mic right there. Okay, so let me place down the button. And I'll show you how this works. So I already set this button up before. Um, let me go in here, the settings. It's really simple. If you don't know how to use the button device, you can click this I card right up here in the top right corner of the screen. If you don't know how to use the button, I have another video on that. Down here, I just put end game as the interaction text. Uh, pretty simple. Okay, let me start the game and let's see if this works. By the way, there's a dance device in the back. Don't mind it. Uh, don't, don't mind it. Actually, it might turn on when I click this. So the device is right here. So we, when we click this button, end game, the game should end, and it should say, I win. Let's test it. There we go. There we go, victory, and I put you win. That Your custom message will go there. And, yeah, that's pretty much it for the device. It's a really cool device. You can use it if you want to get to an end of a parkour map, or you can use it to, not to manage scores, but you can use it to... To say which team wins when the game ends, depending on their score. You could do a lot of stuff with this end game device. Um, it's a really cool device, so you can use it in a lot of ways. Uh, if this video help you, if this video helped you out, consider subscribing, leaving a like, and using my code in the Fortnite item shop. My code is peeper1235, and it would be mean the world to me if you would use my code. Also, once again, if you have any questions about anything in my videos, go down to the comment section below and comment anything you would like. Any questions, I reply to anything. Uh, if I can, make sure you word it right, because otherwise I won't be able to read it. Also, one last thing. Once again, thank you so much for getting me monetized. If there is a thanks button down there below the video, consider leaving a donation to the channel. It will help a lot. It makes me keep, it makes me keep making videos and keep rolling before i sign off i would like to show you some bloopers from today's video i don't know why but this video took uh, a good amount of time to record so i just want to show you some fun bloopers before i go hopefully you enjoy before i sign off i guys oh my god i can't even do this three two one hello pies welcome back to wait 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 what <laughs> hello pies wait oh my for the activating team, this is the team that can activate it. What? Uh. Okay, for the activate when receiving from, that's... What is that? Uh. The next one here is enable after game starts. Bruh. I'm so stupid! Okay, if you guys... Alexa, cancel. Bro! You even Alexa's messing me up! Hello guys, welcome back to a new video on the Wanna Scissor channel where we talk about everything Fortnite creative related. Today I'm gonna be going over the this this big red blob device. Yeah, look at this! I forgot the name of it! It's Endgame! It's so obvious! If you guys would like to support the channel, leave a comment down below. Wait, 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 no, please. No, no, you don't leave a comment down below. No, you, cl you click the thanks button. No! Keep rolling. So thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. See you next time. A sister out.